Earlier, whenever we wanted to embed Lightning Web Components as quick actions, there was not any straightforward approach for that. The route that we were taking is we were creating Aura Components like this, and we also made sure that the Aura Components implements Force Colon Lightning Quick Actions. Now, when an Aura Component implements Force Colon Lightning Quick Actions, this Aura Component is going to get the capability such that this component can be plugged in as a Lightning Quick Action. So, Aura Component has to be created and this piece has to be added and after that we went ahead and we tried embedding lightning web components within the aura components like this once after the lightning web component is embedded in aura component back in the org it is going to be pretty much straightforward we need to navigate back to the object page and then click on buttons links and actions click on new action go ahead with lightning component there you go we have the aura component but starting Spring 21 release, we can create a Lightning Web Component and we can use that as a quick action straight out of the box. We don't have to do this workaround. And for that, we need to create a Lightning Web Component and in the targets, we need to add a target like this. Now the documentation has not specified that a target is going to look something like this. I'm trying to take an educated guess here. It is going to be something on the lines of Lightning double underscore quick action with Q and A written in caps letters. Once again, the documentation has not specified anything about this. If I were to take a guess, it is going to be something on these lines. Now, Lightning Web Component has to be created. This target has to be added. We need to push it back to the arc. And finally, after that, whenever we try to create buttons, links, and actions, here it is going to show us one more new option, which is going to be Lightning Web Component. Now, there's a catch here. The catch is this feature is in pilot, meaning you cannot spin up a pre release arc and you cannot test this feature out. You need to get in touch with the customer support team and you need to ask them to enable it or you need to get in touch with your AE to get this feature enabled. That's all for this episode. See you in the next one.